All right, y'all, today we are making rotisserie chicken salad, and I'm making it deluxe with pecans and grapes, and oh my goodness, is it over the top. Y'all have got to try this recipe. All right, the first thing we're gonna do is use our chicken off of our rotisserie, and I'm gonna use a little dark meat and white meat. Now, the chicken that I have right here is actually two rotisserie chickens. And this recipe is for one rotisserie chicken. So what I'm gonna do, and this is a really big rotisserie chicken because it came from Sam's. So there's actually more meat than you would normally get off of a chicken from the grocery store. So this is probably enough right here. Um, we're gonna just chop up this chicken and we'll be using some more of our chicken and chicken and dumplings and different recipes like that this week. So you're just gonna chop up your chicken. Just chop it, you know, however you like it. I actually like my chicken to be small in my chicken salad. And so that's the way mama raised me. So that's what I like. So a little dark and a little white will make it delicious. My mama used to make this all the time with grapes and pecans because she was a caterer. And um, I've never made it for y'all that way. So I thought it's the new year and I'm gonna make a deluxe chicken salad. All right, so I'm gonna add my chicken to my bowl. You're just gonna slice your onion and try to get it super fine for chicken salad. I'm gonna add celery chopped, an onion chopped fine, And I like to see the red onion in it, but Chris does not do well with red onion. And that's why you don't see me cook with it a lot because um, his body doesn't do well with it. So therefore I hardly ever use it, but I think it's pretty. Um, so if you wanna use red onion, you can. Now what we're gonna do is we're going to put in a half cup of mayonnaise. And I actually bought the olive oil mayonnaise that's light since it's the new year. <laughs> half cup of mayonnaise. And now we're gonna use a half teaspoon of dill weed. It just makes it taste good. And a quarter teaspoon of pepper. This is a half teaspoon, so I'll just fill it half full. Now the mayonnaise usually has plenty of salt in it. And so we're also going to add grapes. And it's a heaping half cup and a, about a half cup of chopped pecans. And we're gonna mix this up. And I'm gonna use a spoon so I can get it mixed good. This is one of my favorite things ever. Nothing better to me than chicken salad put in a beautiful croissant, a buttery croissant. And the grapes, you just half them. And the larger grapes I actually cut in quarters. So I cut them um, into four pieces instead of two pieces. This is a lot of chicken. I may have to add a little extra mayonnaise to it. Um, like I said, you get a lot more chicken with a Sam's Club chicken than you do with a grocery store chicken. And you know what just blows my mind? Sam's Club has not edited the price of the rotisserie chickens as far as I know. They're still $4.98 and y'all, you can't even buy a whole chicken for that anymore. So it's crazy not to buy them. So when I go in there, I stock up. You can freeze it. Cut it off and freeze it and use it in casseroles. And it's quick and easy. Something you can have quick and easy. Now we're just gonna mix this up and I'm gonna taste it and make sure it tastes good. Now red grapes would make it pretty too. But I bought a fruit tray for us to snack on and it had green grapes so that's what I'm using. I like to use my spoon and smash this chicken a little bit so that it's all, not all in these real big hunks, but has some smaller pieces to fill in the gaps. 
for your sandwich. And the more this marinates, the better it's gonna be because of the onion. Now, if for some reason you don't have a fresh onion, you can always use dehydrated onions. Always have them on hand or onion powder and it's gonna make it taste good. Now we're gonna give it a try. Did have a lot of chicken in it. I might wanna add something else. I gotta make sure it's salty and all that good stuff. Mm, mm, mm. This is really delicious, and I have not seriously had it with pecans and grapes in it. Gosh, it's, I was pretty young because my kids, I've always made it for the kids, and they just love it plain. And so today, this is a treat for us for the new year, and I've got on my flashy shirt for the new year too today. So we're going to plate this up. Me and Chris are going to have a feast for lunch. So I got us a croissant, and you can toast it if you want to. Um, if you got an air fryer, just put it in there for a couple of minutes on 350, and that'll work. And now we're going to get some of this chicken salad in our croissant. The grapes are just going to make it delicious, too. I didn't even get a grape in the bite I took, and it was just so good without it, really. So when I get about a grape, I'm really going to like it. I like to pile it high when I make a chicken salad sandwich. So here's our sandwich. And most of the time when you get chicken salad, you really ought to get you some good fruit to go with it. I got a little bit of pineapple today, a little strawberry, and there you have it, chicken salad. Now here, this is a big football day. A lot of y'all are making appetizers and different things. And I'm going to tell you, chicken salad is perfect to feed everybody or even have it as an appetizer and serve it on crackers or whatever you want to do with it. And it's very versatile, so run and get your rotisserie today. Um, and we're going to give this a try. And I know it's delicious, but I want to taste it with a croissant with y'all. It's a big sandwich. And they make the tiny croissants too. So you might could serve uh, the tiny croissants. Mm, mm, mm. We have also made this when we have big parties and use the tart shells. Heat those tart shells up and then fill them up, put it on the table, and boy, do they disappear fast. I just hope you've enjoyed watching deluxe rotisserie chicken salad and coming up i'm going to show you how to make chicken and dumplings out of a rotisserie chicken so um i'll try to link it to this later in the future but look for that video on sunday all right thanks so much for watching hit the like button and we love you here at colored valley cooks where we cook like our mamas did bye